Hi, my name is Kevin. Today I'm going to uh, show you how to start a steam turbine and put the low on. Now, so before we start that, uh, we have to put the auxiliary equipment on first. That means the condenser, the cooling tower, and water pump. Okay, so now, and um, also we have to also make sure uh, the oil, uh, the governor is okay, the oil for the uh, bearing is uh, okay, and also the drain of the turbine uh, had to be open to let the water out. So now I'm going to turn on the steam slowly to the turbine and make it turn slowly for a few moments. So you can see the turbine is slowly turning now. Eh? So let it slow turning. And then next one, eh? next step, I have to check one of the the slinger wing for the the uh, lubrication. So I open it up. There is a wing in there supposed to be turning. So we want to make sure it's turning. Yeah, it is turning okay. So there's oil sprouting everywhere to lubricate the bearing. So there is another one. Um, at the front, so there's another one at the front there. It's the same thing. Make sure that it's turning. Yeah, it is turning in there. I can see that. Now the next step, I have to test the safety device. Okay, and I can see some steam coming out from the exhaust. So I'm gonna close the valve there. Now, and so the drain valve there. So. Uh, uh, check is any water coming out or not so later on you can shut it off when the water is gone eh? so the next step eh, we have to test the uh, over speed trip which is a is a safety device you just hit the handle eh? uh, hit the handle and make sure the mechanism works okay so after you hit that you don't do anything and you wait for the the turbine sharp to slow down and you can see this uh, the turbine is slowing down now eh? So this uh, is a safety device. Now, so if the turbine is running too fast, and the mechanism will will stop the turbine itself. Eh? So every time we start it, we have to test it, make sure the linkage is working okay before we actually put the turbine online. So right now you see the the turbine is slowly uh, slowing down. Eh? So. We just wait for it, wait uh, a few more moments until the, the computer stop. So I can see that now, uh, it pretty much stop now, eh? okay? So I'm gonna uh, close the steam valve to the turbine. And then I'm gonna uh, reset the over speed trip. So just pull it up now. And then I can slowly open the steam valve again and make the turbine turn again. Now usually uh, when the turbine is cold eh, we have to slow low it for 15 minutes before we can put it online. But today we have to we have already warm up the turbine. So I can I'm gonna just uh, slowly open up the steam valve and make the turbine run into the operation speed. Okay uh, opening the, the steam valve Now, so this turbine uh, is hooked up to a single phase generator. So uh, it generates some uh, electricity. Huh? So now you can see the, the turbine shop is running uh, really, really fast now. Eh? Okay. Now, so the next step, I'm going to uh, have to check the frequency on my um, uh, a generator. So in, in North America, we run at uh, 60 hertz, uh, so we want to make sure it is one at 60 hertz. Oh, right now it's way, way over, almost 65, uh, so I better turn it down a little bit. So by turning the, the, the governor, uh, I can slow down the turbine, and then the hertz will slow down. Right now it's a 60 and a half, so I turn a little bit more. Uh, yeah, it is 60. Eh? So what you want to do is you want to check and make sure it's 60 hertz and 240 volts. Now we are ready to uh, put uh, some some low on the turbine. That means we are ready to generate electricity. So 
this is a single phase turbine. Eh? So now we have a device in there that help uh, we us to put some load on. So the load bearing control. Eh? So we put on. Uh, so uh, emergency stop is also up, turn on. And then I put on the the breaker for the the heat heat, heat bearing eh? and the, also for the light. So next step, I turn the emergency stop to the clockwise, and it will pop out and the low off side will come on so I'm ready so I put the low on putting on so I'm ready to put the put generate some electricity so now I'm gonna put uh, 1000 uh, watt a heating element on okay and then I'm gonna go over there and put uh, turn on the switch uh, each one is 500 watts okay 500 another one Another 500. The total is uh, 2,000 watts. Okay. Now after I put the the load on, eh, I have to recheck my frequency. You see, the thing dropped down to uh, 159 and a half already. Eh? So it's okay like that. But I want to just adjust it to 160 hertz. Eh? Anywhere 659 and a half and 60 and a half would be okay. So I'm going to turn it up to 160. So. Now it's 60, yeah. So now uh, you, we are ready to put some more load on. Okay. So that is how you put uh, the turbine on.